And welcome everyone, it's me Picky Gammy here. Welcome to the Special Mutants Genetic Lady AD News, guys. It's the seventh anniversary, and news is out. It came out abruptly. It's uh I'm I'm onto it straight after, you know, well, not straight after, but Proc Reveals uh posted it. FYI, he's where I get all the uh information for the news from. So guys, go down to the link. His link's in the description below. If you want to know the news firsthand, you should already be following him, but there's a link to his page there anyway. So, guys, starting in, as of this recording, uh, what is it? There's, it's 4.30, so it's 5, 6, 7, 8. There's like three, four hours, three and a half hours to go. <laughs> By the time this video is out, probably two, two and a half hours to go. Uh, until the event 70th year anniversary officially officially begins guys so without further ado let's get into it guys okay so <clears throat> the first week which is like it's it's now there's not much going on but it's now 28th to the 6th awakening part one and that's where you fight the missy new missy awakened or awakened missy uh muted so it's, it's going to be climbing the ladder one to, 0 to 100, I believe. Uh, we'll look into it in more details. They've also got exclusive anniversary offers. So, you know, real money to get gold. And their seven, special seven-year tokens, which you use to buy, thus, mutants. Okay, so the next week, guys. So, uh, Normal news, uh, back for 24 hours only, mutant per day, we'll go through them one by one once we get there, buy two, get one free, level five shield orb, uh, we've got a evolution center upgrade, so look, because it's seven years, we we are we are hoping that it's, uh, that it's going to be minimum 80%, but possibly 90 I think they've hit 90% once, and that was, that was very early on, and I don't even think it was for an anniversary, it was for no reason at all. Um, anniversary super pack. I don't think it's so super. <laughs> so I don't have one of those mutants there, but I'm not going to spend 3,000 plus gold on getting that extra one mutant, because uh, the other two are crap, and I don't know if that third one, and I'm talking about the one that looks like it's a police car mutant thing on the uh, on the right hand side uh i don't know if he's any good but again i don't see him in pvp and i'd say save your gold then guys seriously limited offer you can buy 56 i don't know why why'd they make it 56 because most of the things are seven anyway uh 56 seven year tokens and that will cost you some gold limited offer we got a mythological box and then awakening part two so we get another climb the ladder type deal starting on the 6th finishing on the 15th um it looks like you face missy again if i'm not mistaken or maybe that's another form of missy who knows who knows but i don't even think the beta tested part two yet guys so let's dive in and see what this mutant looks like first i don't know if i've shown her on a previous mutant news but it's about her, so let's put it back up if, if I have. So, Missy's the new mutant. Her genos are Saber and Robot, or Cyber, which, whatever way you prefer to call it. But, in the game, you can look at her, and you look at her at Saber Robot, but then, in the details, it's got Saber Alien. Now, I'm assuming it's Saber Robot, but they've done this to us before, guys, where they've changed, like, a, a, a shield to her health and things like that and she is a boost character which is good i like boost and shield i can work with both of them so that's it she's an exclusive mutant so she doesn't star up uh from bronze to platinum and all that so what you see is what you get those are her damage outputs um first glance they seem kind of low but again when she gets that massive boost that may compensate for I, I i don't know we'll have to tinker around with her see if she's any good uh i'm i'm sure the guys in the beta if they can be bothered level up max level on her up you know they may be able to see if they're any good or not if she's any good or not so guys during this event in i don't know which way it is in the exchange office that's probably that way in the exchange office that's where you're going to spend these seven year tokens guys now 
this is all that the Pokerfield site has shown me. Um, I thought that we would be able to buy a previous year's uh, anniversary mutants like Animus, guys. And um, there's still a chance it could be in there. But with this picture, this is look. This looks like that's all available. But I'll be a little bit disappointed if we can't buy the previous minion, especially for you guys, because you guys, if you watch my video a lot, you guys know how good Animus is. And that's the double alien Geno, just in case you wonder if you want to check it out yourself. Double alien Geno or galactic Geno. Um, Animus or ir irrelevant, something, something Animus. Um, okay, so 77... Uh, seven year tokens gets you one silver star. That will be the last thing you'd want to buy. Obviously, you want Missy the unit. 777 tokens you need. That is a lot of tokens, and obviously, year seven, so 777. They could have just done that 77. And ooh, other the next things you'd want to buy um, is the level seven health orb and level seven attack orb. I don't think we've ever seen these in the game again. Uh, I know I haven't, but. I have taken a hiatus from the game, uh, you know, before coming back again. So, um, they may have done it then, but I, I don't think so. Seven years, 343 tokens for them. Holy moly, guys. Okay, so, during this video, guys, if I remember, if I don't, I'm going to tell you anyway, but I'll try and put a little token, seven-year tokens, and how much we're going to be earning through this event, because... When I did a quick calculation, so I don't know how we're going to get the 777, but I'm sure I'm missing some things and they're going to add some things that we're just not aware of yet. So let's go into it. So the first part, Awakening 1, guys. It's up above my head. I don't know where it is at the moment, but it's 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 on screen right now. So, uh, yes, it goes up to the level 100 and you get these uh, prizes as the level displays level 7, 10, 14, 20, 21, blah, blah, blah. It goes on and on. But you get seven, you get seven, seven year anniversary tokens. <laughs> there, seven, oh, so many sevens. So in Awakening Part One, you get a total of ninety-eight year seven tokens. Okay, and then after this first part's done, we move over into Part Two. So in Part Two, you also have ninety-eight seven year tokens to collect, which brings the grand total to a one hundred and ninety-six tokens we also have missions during now this is what i don't know i don't know if this is a first part mission or missions throughout so we might get a part two i'm not sure and i don't read the spanish or whatever language it is so i don't know <laughs> anything with other cultures you guys know that if you watch me for long enough these are the uh missions to do so it's like you know climb the ladder do this much damage kill this much mythologicals uh, breed, incubate five mutants, win PvP battles, etc, etc. So that will net you a total of 140 Year 7 Anniversary Tokens, which brings the grand total to 336. So we can't even still buy the uh, level seven, 7 Attack and Health Orbs. During, and this is what they've done previously, you, you can buy a present a day. I think they did this for Christmas last time. If not, it was the other anniversary. However, so 30 gold, good value for gold, guys. If you've got the gold, definitely, definitely get these. They'll be worth it unless you want to just pinpoint certain days. But you do also get tokens out of this, so you may need them. So there's a total of one, two, three, four, five, and then the next one, six, seven, eight, nine, nine presents, as they clearly state there anyway. Nine presents to get with those um, items. You also get a mutant, you know, it's not a great one, I don't say in PV, PvP, so don't jump for joy over that. But the important is you get seven, seven year tokens out of all of them, except for the third one, uh, Present three, you get 21. So if you buy all those presents, guys, it's worth 77 year seven tokens, which brings a grand total to 413. So now we can buy one of the uh, the level seven attack or health orbs. However, we want to go for Missy first. And then they've also got this, the bank offer, exceptional bank offer that chucks in a lot of tokens and you know 100 bucks you can buy 700 of them and all that but 
So obviously to pay to play players, you can you can get a bit more tokens this way, but you'll be spending quite a bit if you want to get quite a bit of tokens. But you also get gold mix in there. So this is just for those people that pay. I still think these prices are just a bit steep. That that's my honest opinion. That again, you know, if this was a massive game that hit top gross in in, in Google Play and I I iTunes store constantly yes I can get those prices but it's not so let's let's lower it make it much more you know if you want to pay make it much more friendly for people to pay so uh, anyway that's up there for you guys just in case you want to spend some money on the game um, so we'll pause the uh, the we're at 413 tokens so we'll go through the mutants that are available on the first, second, third, and fourth. You've got these mutants available. Uh, look, Project X is pretty good, but kind of old now. Um, so if you're going to spend gold, but again, you guys should be saving you. You know, the, the missing mutants probably going to be better than this. So Project X, okay. But again, I got Zeus, so it's not important. I've got the mutant anyway. And the same goes for that Pixie Fairy one. Uh, it's for credits. If you haven't got it, pick it up for credits. If you have got it, then just move on. On the fifth, you've got this one. Again, not a great mutant. You've got a heroic box available at some time in the second part, guys. A thousand gold per summon. Now, this is a whoops. This is the first time that Gerard Steel Garden is going to be available for gold. However, it's a if you go to the heroic grid, you'll see how many heroic mutants there are. So you've got a one in however many there are. Let's just take a figure at the top of my head and say 12. One in 12 chance of getting him. I don't know. There might be more heroic mutants than that. Probably are. So, you know, it's you, you calculate the odds. Yeah. So I, that that's all the comments I've heard once this, this news got posted about the uh, heroic box. Oh, chance to get still gutted you're playing with fire just in in all honesty but it's i understand if you guys are really wanting to chase him uh you got the level five shield orbs but you get one free you got this mutant for real money which i've never seen used in pvp ever so it's not worth it uh and then you got the uh the three mutants for gold three thousand five hundred gold comes with 50 xp jars but that's not important uh, again, I don't see any of those mutants in PvP, so again, it's it's just save your gold. 3,500 is really steep with the gold. I purposely would skip this one. Um, I don't have that mutant, so maybe I might not. It was available in PvP at one point in time, I'm pretty sure. I don't know, I'm sure we'd be back. Might, might not spend it. Uh, and then you've got the tokens, guys. You can buy 56 tokens for 300 gold. Now, it all comes down to are they going to limit it to one bot purchase two purchase or three purchases or make it unlimited so this is where maths comes into it guys so currently we were sitting at 413 uh year seven tokens um so if they only allow us to buy one 56 that brings us to 469 yeah um so 469 it's that's that's still not enough to buy missy so then if there's no other way to get tokens which th this is what i believe that there's got to be other ways to get tokens because you should be able to get that missing mutant as a free-to-play player if you're going to grind everything out i truly believe that so i reckon there will be more tokens available but with the news that i've gotten guys uh, the images that i'm sh being shown there's no more so I'm, I'm sure there will be to, to allow people to everyone to get her and not have it as a pay to get her type deal. Uh, but by the, by the slim chance that they don't do that, so 300 gold for 56 tokens. So I've done the maths and you will need to purchase this seven more times. Because remember, we're at 413 tokens. We'll have to purchase... 56 tokens, seven more times to get the amount needed to purchase Missy. And purchasing this pack seven times is going to set you back 2,100 gold. So keep that in mind. And if they don't give us any more, then you've got to resort to that if you've got the gold. 
again, I don't know if the meeting's worth it. That's that's the other thing. Um, might have to hit up uh, hit up my friends who uh, did the beta testing and uh, hopefully test it out, tested her out, leveled it up, uh, leveled up Missy, tested her out, and see if she's worthwhile. Because you know, if we have to spend two thousand one hundred gold, it's and that's what I mean. It's like you should be able to earn. I really believe that you should be able to earn it if if you're free to play just by grinding. So just just keep that in mind. And that, that's all the tokens. So that's all the tokens that I've seen. And then you got the mythological box for 700 gold. Okay. And guys, so that is all the news that I have for you. That's all the tokens that I've seen available to us. <laughs> so please keep that in mind, guys. Um, when, when you are doing the event, uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I'll, I'll, I'll try and talk to the guys at Celsius just to see if we've got any more tokens coming up our way that we're just not aware of. Maybe there's a part two of missions. Uh, missions brought us 140, so if we're still sitting at 413, that pushes it to 553. So that's still not enough to purchase it. So there has to be more way. Maybe there's a part three? Maybe. Uh, 400, so... 500, 600, that pushes us to, yeah. Maybe there's a part one, part two, part three, and part one, part two, part three missions as well. I, I don't know, but we definitely need a lot, more, a lot more to reach a 777. Anyway, guys, that is it from me. Uh, I may be streaming the event when it comes out, if not the next day, but I'm definitely going to be getting on and streaming this event. I've got a new game coming out that I'm going to be playing soon that comes out in like 2 a.m. my time i'm gonna be wrecked guys and but i'm gonna be pumping content out to you as best i can grant give and keep in mind i still do work a normal job so i'm not just a youtuber or anything like that old content creator i might as well say anyway guys that is it from your boy picky here i want to thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this news episode you know please hit that thumbs up guys and show your support you want to go that little extra further guys and help your party picky out feel free to share this video on any social media platform or form as you see fit thank you so much for watching guys i'll see you all next time bye